Gotcha, boy. How old is he? What's your name? I'm Balfire and I'm 13. If the loss is in the fight, I... I can fight. What was interesting about Balefire as a young boy is he might have been a little more like his mom. He was ready to go to the Ogre's War. He was a little more brave than his father, but he had a good heart, and he loved his dad, and he realized that the mission he needed to do was save his father, and that's what made him seek out the Blue Fairy. That's what made him want to go to a land without magic, because the only way to get rid of the Dark One is to kill the Dark One, and he wanted to be with his father. You see, what ails your father is specific to our realm. His powers do not belong here. You must go where you can escape this wretched curse. Go? We have to leave? Yes. It is the only way. Can you do it? Can you leave everything here behind for the unknown? If it means I get my father back, then yes. When we find him years later, in a lot of ways, he's living out of a stolen car. He is doing a lot of the things that you wouldn't expect, but kind of you would because he had to grow up knowing that his father chose power over him. Please! I can't! You coward! You promise! Don't break our deal! I have to! Papa! The Hellfire fell through the portal and landed in London. It was taken off the streets and into the home of the Darling family as much as you like. Really? <laughs> well, I'm not about to let you starve to death. What's your name? Bay. Bay? How unusual. I'm Wendy. Wendy Darling. One of the reasons that he and Emma get along so well and fell in love was because you have two people who feel like they were abandoned by their parents and two people that had to live on their own who are ready to let their walls come down. Is this what you really want? What I really want is you. When you really love somebody, you just want to be with them. And to have to deny that is hard to yourself, and it's also hard because he knew he was going to break her heart. You love her, good. That means you have to do right by her. That's all I'm trying to do. Then leave her. So the fact that he would add to the pain that he was trying to take away is really hard to live with. I tried to lose myself. That didn't work. Talk to you about Emma. I hope you're not trying to reach out. I just I feel like if, if I knew that she was okay, I could move on. He understands that this destiny is important for her and he can't be in the way. And I think that is that is really it's a self-sacrifice that I think he regrets every day. I wanted to look for you. I just I, I was too afraid. What? She would never forgive me. Because I never forgave myself. There hasn't been a day that's gone by that I don't regret having left you.